Day Trip to Donegal by Derek Mahan We reached the sea in early afternoon, climbed stiffly out. There were things to be done, clothes to be picked up, friends to be seen. As ever, the nearby hills were a deeper green than anywhere in the world, and the grave grey of the sea, the grimmer in that enclave. Down at the pier, the boats gave up their catch, a writhing glimmer of fish. They fetched ten times as much in the city as here, and still the fish come in year after year. Herring and mackerel flopping about the deck in attitudes of agony and heartbreak. We left at eight, drove back the way we came, the sun receding down each muddy lane. Around midnight, we changed down into suburbs, sunk in a sleep no gale force wind disturbs. The time of year had left its mark on frosty pavements glistening in the dark. Give me a ring, good night, and so to bed. That night, the slow sea washed against my head, performing its immeasurable erosions, spilling into the skull, marbling the stones that spine the very harbour wall, muttering its threat to villages of landfall. At dawn I was alone, far out at sea, without skill or reassurance, nobody to show me how, no promise of rescue, cursing my constant failure to take due forethought for this, contriving vain overtures to the vindictive wind and rain.